am perpetually with you. Let's look at Matthew 6.34 and also John 10.10. 10. Matthew 6.34 says, So do not worry, saying, What shall we eat, or what shall we drink, or what shall we wear? For the pagans run after all these things. And your heavenly Father, he knows that you need them. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. And it's real cute I have over here off the side. If I am rightly related to God and obey his spirit, God will take care of my feathers. Talking about how, you know, he takes care of the birds of the air. He's going to take care of your feathers, my friend. So don't worry. You won't be naked. I am perpetually with you, my friend. Taking care of you. That is the most important fact of your existence. I am not limited by time or space. My presence with you is a forever promise. You need not fear the future, for I am already there. When you make that quantum leap into eternity, you will find me awaiting you in heaven. Your future is in my hands. I release it to you day by day, moment by moment. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow. I want you to live this day abundantly, seeing all there is to see, doing all there is to do. Don't be distracted by future concerns. Leave them to me. Each day of life is a glorious gift, but so few people know how to live within the confines of today. Much of their energy for abundant living spills over the timeline into tomorrow's worries or past regrets. Oh, that's really good. I'm going to back that one up and read that one again. Much of their energy for abundant living spills over the timeline into tomorrow's worries or past regrets. The remaining energy is sufficient only for limping through the day. Let's not limp, people. Let's not limp. Not for living it in full. I am training you to keep your focus on my presence in the present. This is how to receive abundant life, which flows freely from my throne of grace. I love this line. Your future is in my hands. I release it to you day by day, moment by moment. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow. So my friends, he's not going to give you enough grace for the entire week, much less, you know, the month or the year. It's day by day. Every day he releases enough grace for today, which could be a Tuesday or a Wednesday or whatever day it might be. He's going to release that amount. And then the next time, another that amount for the next day. And that's how he does it day by day. Look at Mandy. She's so calm and just trust me. She knows every day that I'm going to feed her, don't you? Yes. Look at how cute she is. She's so cute and she trusts me. We need to trust God the same way. He's going to give us food. He's going to give us enough of everything that we need just for that day. So I hope today, my friend, that you are trusting him, knowing that he, even though he created everything and he holds the whole world in his hands, you are part of that and you are going to be resting in his hands. And he has got you, my friend. So don't worry today. Just trust in him that today you're going to get enough just for today. And that tomorrow, don't worry about it because he's already in our future and he's going to cover you tomorrow too. Have a great day trusting and I'll see you back here tomorrow. You can order your own Jesus Calling devotional book by going to JesusCalling.com. And I would love to answer any questions you may have about faith in Jesus. Just email me through my website, NancyJoyToYou.com. And I hope you go out and shine for Him today. See you tomorrow.